Louie, head coach and GM of the 87, out of a 4 2 loss in your final round robin game. Take us through your thoughts. Oh, it was a good game. Uh, it was intense, a lot of uh, really physical um, and to be expected, right? Both teams trying to get the top seed, and, and you know, that's what we expected it to be. So, uh, a good physical game uh, came down to the end, and you know, a couple bounces go the other way, the game goes the other way. So, good game, uh, obviously, uh, for us to get ready for tomorrow. Not a shot the other game, but we had two today that both didn't technically mean anything because you were all four teams were going on. This one felt more intense. Why? I think it came from the first period. I think it was very physical. I think guys were going, guys were really jammed up. And then when you get going, I think both teams are super competitive, right? So it, when that came down to that, I think that takes over and the, and the boys started playing really well and started going. So the game definitely felt like it was being played for something. Now you get a team in the Wolves who has probably had the toughest road to get here. Mm -hmm. What challenges do they present for you tomorrow? Yeah, they're good. I mean, uh, this entire week they've been good. The entire playoffs they've been good. They're hot. Um, so for us, it's going to be, you know, we have to take down a team that's playing at their top right now. So uh, it's a challenge that, you know, we're going to have to take and, and hopefully overcome, um, you know, and just really get going, playing our game, worry about what we need to do to win versus what we need to do to stop them from winning. So we're going to worry about what we need to do and, and go from there. Of course, you're more focused on your, your game, not the second game, which is the Railers and the Express, but how much would you like one more shot of the Railers on Sunday? Yeah, just want to have a good game on Saturday okay. and see what happens. <laughs> Let's bring in Sean Bertone now. Uh, not our best effort. Uh, first period, I thought, was uh, physical. Uh, I thought both teams were going at it pretty hard. Uh, our effort and energy, I thought, dropped in the second and third. And if you don't have effort and energy, the execution is going to drop. So, uh, you know, not our best effort, but the guys found a way to win. Flashback to the January showcase. Back-to-back -back games, Little Fires and 87, they both beat you 5-2. to two. Come here, you get revenge in both of those. Is it revenge or just focused on the finals right now? Focus. Uh, yeah, we, we know what's at stake. And again, we worry about us and uh, coming to the rink and playing a disciplined, hard nosed game. And, um, you know, we're here. We have a mission and uh, we set goals at the beginning of the year and, and we're trying to accomplish those goals. And now, as you look forward, you get a team different from the 87s and the Wolves. You get a team in Wolf where they have faced a few times this year. What challenges do they present you tomorrow? Very good team. Uh, solid team, hard on pucks. They defend very well. Uh, extremely well coached team. Um, they have depth. Uh, we know it's good. We know what we're in for, and we got to bring our game. Congrats. See you tomorrow. Thanks, Neil.